Hey everybody, we left Alberta yesterday and made it into British Columbia and uh, we stayed at Dawson Creek. No, not that Dawson's Creek. Dawson Creek, British Columbia. It's the, uh, where the Alaskan Highway starts, mile zero of the Alaska Highway. And uh, we just stayed here for a night and now we're going to start driving Alaskan Highway. We're excited and all the kids are super excited. They can't wait. All right, so finally made it to mile zero of the Alaska Highway, Dawson Creek. Um, I've waited my whole life to do this. The boys haven't have to wait so long. They're all pretty young. So this is uh, something I've been waiting for my whole life. So let's go check it out. They have a sign for uh, uh, Dawson Creek. Dawson Creek sticker for us. We're gonna plop a sticker up there. We're we gonna put it. All right, there's two boards. This one's kind of empty. This one's pretty full. So we're going to. I think we're gonna put it right under here. We're underneath the adventure right here. Bam. Big family expedition of Venice Shore. Alaska Highway. Historical marker. You are now entering the world famous Alaska Highway, Dawson Creek, British Columbia. Where are you guys from? Uh, Arkansas originally. Ar oh, back to Missouri originally, and then we were in Arkansas. That's a long ways. Yeah. How many miles is that to here? Like 3,000 miles? Yeah, it's a lot. It's a lot. Yeah. Thanks. Yep. Uh -huh. No problem. Thank you. You guys going all the way to Alaska? Yes. Yeah. You going? Yes. Yeah. Oh, wow. First time, you guys? First time? Yeah. 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 So exciting! Yeah, yeah, I know, right? Where are you guys from? We're from Napa. California, San Francisco. Okay. Area. That's a long drive too. Yeah. So there's this signpost and these. There's some on the back. If you guys had a sticker up here somewhere, give us a comment. Let us know which sign it was on. Or is that? Just sign one, sign two, oh, I guess it'd be sign one, sign two, sign three. Let us know. We stopped at the old Alaska Highway, Cascatano Bridge. It's closed the traffic, but we brought the bus down so we could walk on a little bit. And uh, it's an amazing view. It's a beautiful view of the bridge. Um, but looking at it, you can tell why it's closed to traffic. It's really old and a lot of wood. <laughs> so. All right, well, this is a neat stop, but uh, we got more to see. A new place, a new home for a while. Let me feel alive. Nothing to hold me back, take my time, just enjoy the ride. I know man, passing by, life is good, best I've ever felt. Get me up, so in it, so I can find myself. Oh, I feel, I feel, I feel, I feel so alive. I reach out, reach out, reach out, reach out to the sky. I found my way. I found my way. I was in the dark against the also stopped here at the Taylor Visitor Center. Um, a lot of information about the Alaska Highway and the area around here. Super nice people. So if you're passing through, make sure you check it out. I found my way. I found my way. In bad times, I know I'll be okay Cause I found my way Hey, we pulled off at a rest area before some steep grades and uh, just rested for a little bit Got some snacks and uh, we're gonna drive again and we're headed that way north Cause I found my way I 
was in the dark against it all, but made it through the day. Cause I found my way, I found my way. In bad times, I know I'll be okay. Cause I found my way. Alright, so this is our campsite for the night. We uh we parked the bus on a turnout just off the highway, the Alaskan Highway, 36 miles from Fort Nelson. Um, there's a bunch of these turnouts that you can pull over, so we're just gonna stay here for the night. The weather is amazing. It's almost, it's cool outside. It's almost hoodie weather, not quite, but almost. It's gonna be good sleeping tonight. But we can't have the windows open because, you know, mosquitoes. Um, we got enough battery power to get us through more than one night, so we'll be good for the night. And then we're gonna get some sleep. Wake up early in the morning and keep on keeping on. We're at the Testa River Lodge. It's supposed to have really good cinema rolls. We're gonna go check it out, see if they're good. Okay. All right, so we got our cinema rolls from the Test River Lodge. They were good. Now we're off to the next place. We're gonna keep on driving that way. Life is a winding road. No telling where it goes. Driving through days and nights. Won't stop for traffic lights And I I really wanna know, really wanna know If I Let me figure out where the road goes Even if I'm falling down I will keep on searching for my highs Say I lost my mind I will keep on holding my head high Even if the sky is falling down Jumping from cliffs so high Trusting our wings to fly Sometimes we're crashing down But we get up and start from the ground I will keep on holding my head high 
Even if the sky is falling down crossing it from British Columbia into the Yukon the first time. We do that like six times, I think, before we stay in the Yukon. And uh, there's this sign with a bunch of stickers on it. So we're gonna put one up there. Go ahead. Put it right there at the bottom. No, down further, down further. Yep. Where are they gonna put it? Boom, and there you have it, BFE, on the Yukon sign. I just recorded you in your mom's forest. We're in the signpost forest in Watson Lake, Yukon. And as of 2023, there are almost 100,000 signs that people put up here. Um, we don't know how many signs, we're gonna put a sticker or two up, so. Just gonna let the kids check it out real quick and then we'll be back on our way. We're stuck on the back of this machine. Put one on the back of this machine. Don't eat them. Why? Say why? The Netherlands, 2008. Yeah. We've seen a couple of these. People take city limit signs and bring them here. That's probably not legal. There's one, city of Tacoma, entering Tacoma, population 158,900. All right, so we're headed out. There's literally signs here from all over the world. Every state, the United States, every province in Canada. Um, we've seen stuff from Germany, Netherlands, um, Argentina, all over. Um, we love some stickers. That's all we have. Maybe on the way back we'll have a sign made and we can put up a sign like everybody else. We uh, we passed sign post forest and we went at least 100 kilometers since then and we pulled off this pullout um, along the highway and we haven't decided if we're going to stay here for the night or maybe go to the next one. We're still looking to see where the next one is, uh, plan out and just maybe my head, maybe go to another one or a couple more just depending on how far away they are. 
It is 11.13 and it still looks like this outside. The sun set 12 minutes ago, but you can still see really good. And the temperature outside is amazing. It's almost, almost hoodie weather. That's great, I love it. But um, we might stay here for the night. I gotta work in the morning. So I'm trying to find the best place to do that too. But we're either staying here for the night or we're gonna hit a couple more. But I just wanna show you what it looked like after sunset here. All right, so we ended up staying here last night. Um, Got to bed about midnight, woke up early, worked all day, and now we're headed out. It was a good little spot. Um, I'm glad they have these pullouts along the side of the highway. It's free camping. Um, it's really handy, but we're headed out. It was a great view. Yep. <laughs> So we stopped at a rest area. Everybody can go to the bathroom. And uh, we're on our way to Whitehorse. It's a dreary, rainy day, uh, but still beautiful scenery. We got about 100 kilometers or so to Whitehorse. And then we're gonna stop and uh, refuel and get some snacks and maybe some food. Hey everybody, so we stopped here just north of Haynes Junction. There's a pull out on the side of the road. This one's paved and um, it's 12.53 a.m. We drove a little bit longer tonight because I had to work this morning. I had to work again tomorrow morning. Um, get up early work and then we'll finish the rest of the drive into Alaska. So, see you in the morning. Hey everybody, so it's the next day and this is the daytime view of where we stayed last night. Right on the Alaskan Highway, some mountains off in the distance, the direction we gotta head. It's also, also some mountains for the trees up there. It's hard to see on the camera, but back there. So it's another nice spot we got to stay at, um, and we gotta head on towards Alaska.
right after a long trip from Destruction Bay, the road was terrible, we finally made it into Alaska and we're about to go see the Alaska sign. Life is a winding road 